I receive a lot of questions accompanied by a drawing. I often redraw them so that they are not a direct copy, but the concept may still be presented in a tip. This tip explains that you should avoid combining directly tolerance dimensions and basic dimensions to define a true profile. The only place in the current standard where it is acceptable and supported to combine the two types of dimensions is when tolerancing conical features. I redrew this part so that readers of the tip could not figure out who committed this error, but you know who you are. This drawing tried to mix tolerance dimensions with basic dimensions. You'll notice that this 36.11 dimension is coming from the edge of the statum feature B, which is a tolerant feature. That's not really what the drawing says to do. So this is not correct. This would be correct. If we look at the profile tolerance, it tells us that the profile is located with respect to the datums established by features A and B. So A is this face down here and so that would give me a datum plane and then B is this diameter and that gives me a fixed axis and since B is regardless of material boundary the old regardless of feature size whether this diameter comes in large or small we're to center up and get that axis so that would be this spot right here that is a fixed spot that I can measure that basic from and then see if this surface is in the profile tolerance. So there's my origin of measurement by the datums established by datum features A and B. This is not a fixed origin. It, datum feature B could come in larger or smaller and it's not fixed. So taking a closer look at the datum reference frame, we have three mutually perpendicular planes this one is established by datum feature A and datum feature B gives us an axis so we would fill this diameter and get an axis we'd be using what's known as the related actual main envelope that axis is the intersection of two planes two perpendicular planes and here is my profile tolerance from that origin so the 1608 basic is from that axis whereas that other dimension the 3611 would be coming from this spot on the surface of the datum feature which is variable so that would be wrong now my second and third datum planes are free to rotate since we've only referenced a b in fact the feature we're trying to control here you see is datum feature c but that's okay what we would do is we would have to rock or rotate those datum planes with the profile zone until we could bring this feature into that tolerance. We make certain the folks we train will not make mistakes like this because at Techies, you know that GD&T rules. I'll see you next tip.